Republican presidential frontrunner Donald Trump vowed an unbreakable bond with Israel, slammed the nuclear deal with Iran and challenged the United Nations for costing too much. Trump, whose worldviews have been rebuked by a section of the Republican establishment, made the comments before a powerful pro-Israel lobby group. The United Nations is not a friend of democracy. It's not a friend to freedom. It's not a friend even to the United States of America, where, as you know, it has its home. And it surely is not a friend to Israel. Democratic presidential frontrunner Hillary Clinton used her appearance before the same American-Israel Public Affairs Committee to attack Trump's knowledge and inexperience of foreign affairs. Yes, we need steady hands. Not a president who says he's neutral on Monday, pro-Israel on Tuesday, and who knows what on Wednesday, because everything's negotiable. The competing speeches pushed the presidential campaign into a new phase in which both candidates appear to have forgotten their primary battles and have begun their fight for the presidency.